क्वेश्चन इज क्वेश्चन नंबर टू टू नाउ फॉर्मुलेट द फॉलोइंग प्रॉब्लम्स एज ए पेयर ऑफ इक्वेशन एंड हेन्स फाइंड दियर सोल्यूशन एंड वॉट इज द प्रॉब्लम प्रॉब्लम इज दैट टू वोमेन एंड फाइव मेन कैन टूगेदर फिनिश एंड एम्ब्रॉयडरी वर्क इन फोर डेज वाइल थ्री वोमेन एंड सिक्स मेन कैन फिनिश इट इन थ्री डेज Find the time taken by one woman alone to finish the work, and also that taken by one man alone. Okay, so we have to. Okay, suppose that the task be finished by finished by. One woman in equal to x days, and by one man in equal to y days. Okay, this I am underlining. Okay, putting under boundary. So. In X days, women can do the full embroidery. Okay, so in one day, how much embroidery she can do? So that will be embroidery, embroidery done by done by one woman in one day. Equal to that is one by x, and by one man in in one day in one day equal to one by y. Okay, these things are clear. Now we will go for forming the that is. forming the equation so what we will do that we can do okay so two two and omen is doing 1 by x plus that is five men so five into 1 by y and they take How many days? They take four days, and task is completed one. Let it be equation number one. Okay. Second way. That is while three women means okay three into one by x plus. Okay, and six men means six into one by y into that is three days into three into here also we should write three equal to one. This is the equation number two. Okay, these two equation if we are solving, we will get the value of x and y. Okay, directly we can't find because this is not in a standard linear form. So first we will formulate the linear form. So this equation one can be written. Okay, from one, from one, what we get that is okay. You write here eight by eight by x. Plus twenty by y, twenty by y equal to one. Okay, from here you can write, and this will be equation number three. From two, what we can get? Three three ja nine by x plus. Six three ja eighteen by y 
equal to one. Let it be equation number four. Okay. Now equation three and four is only useful for us. This thing we have finished. So I will erase this one and take this two equation on the top. Okay. So we will take this one here and this one here. See this equation that is equation three and four is also not in a linear form. So we have to convert to a linear form, and for that we have to assume. And assumption we will do here. Let let one by x equal to m, and one by y equal to n. <coughs> so we will form now. Okay, how we can form? Putting the value in three. From three, from three, what we get? That is. Eight m plus twenty n equal to one. This will be equation number five. Okay, from that is four. What we can get? That is nine m plus eighteen n equal to One, okay. So that is equation number six. Okay. Now equating equation five and six because the right side both are equal. So we can tell that eight m plus twenty n twenty n equal to 9m plus 18n. Okay, we will bring 8 this side and okay, m we will bring right side, n we will bring left side. So we can write okay, what we can write that is uh, 20n or minus that is 18n equal to 9m minus 8m, or we can write that is 2n equal to m. Okay. So we have got the value of m equal to 2n, and I need a space. So what I will do? This 3 and 4 also I will erase. And we will use this space to find the value of. Okay, so putting the value of m in equation six. Okay, from six, when when m equal to two n. Okay, how what we will get from six. So we will write nine into two n. Okay, nine into two n plus eighteen n equal to one. Okay, so now we will solve this one. So eighteen n and eighteen n. Okay, I will erase this one. Further. Okay, eighteen n plus eighteen n equal to one, or we can write thirty six n equal to one, or we can write n equal to one by thirty six. N equal to thirty six. Okay. Okay. So n equal to One by thirty-six. Okay, here we can find the value of y directly. Okay, 
n equal to that is 1 by y from here 1 by 36 equal to 1 by y or or y equal to if we are doing cross multiplication that will be 36 days and here we will write the answer y equal to 36 days this is the job being done by one man okay for that is 36 days he needs a man needs to complete the complete embroidery so y value we have got okay now what we have achieved that if a one man starts doing embroidery then he will take 36 days to complete the embroidery now to calculate the number of days required for the woman okay if single woman is working to do the embroidery how many days she will take to calculate that one we need now that is value of n and that i will retain here n equal to n equal to 1 by 36 also we require that is equation number 6 and 6 is 6 was that is 9m plus 18n equal to 1 this was equation number 6 okay that i will write little more clearly and to write clearly i have to shift a little this side okay then we can write 6 so this two data i will keep and i will find the value of m and in turn x okay and rest thing i will erase rest thing i will erase when okay not a when this is putting the value of putting the value of value of n n equal to 1 by 36 in equation 6 what we are going to get equation 6 is here so 9m plus 18 into 1 by 36 equal to 1 or or 9m equal to you this will get cancelled okay 9m equal to 1 minus 1 by 2 that is 1 by 2 or m equal to 1 by 2 multiply by 9 that is 1 by 18 okay and m equal to 1 by x m equal to 1 by x that is equal to 1 by x or x equal to 18 days x equal to 18 days so if one woman start doing embroidery she will take 18 days to complete the embroidery whereas if a man starts doing embroidery same embroidery then he will take 36 days to complete the embroidery and if two women and five men working together they will take four days and if three women and six men start doing embroidery they will take three days and like that we have completed question number two two now we'll see next question that is question number two three